Hair-based discrimination is now illegal in Nevada. Governor Steve Sisolak signed the Crown Act into law this June. The Crown Act stands for creating a respectful and open world for natural hair. Bianca Holman explains the impact of this new legislation. Hair is a form of expression, identity, and a connection to heritage, especially in the black community. For me, hair is an accessory. You should be able to wear it how you want. It's beautiful, though. It's a very, like, night and day type of thing. If it's wet, the shrinkage is one way. When it's blow-dried, it's another way. For many black women, there's a shared experience growing up. Memories of straightening coily and curly hair through the use of chemicals or heat, oftentimes in order to fit a European beauty standard. Yendra Dixon, who works in a professional setting, says she was met with comments from former co-workers during her hair journey. Definitely microaggressions. Can I touch it? Um, you know, what did you do? You know, when uh, when black women put in braids, all of a sudden it's like, oh, my gosh, you know, what happened to your hair? Because it has transitioned into something completely different. Black women are 80 percent more likely to have changed their hair from its natural state to fit into the office. And they're also one and a half times more likely to be sent home from work because of their hair. That's according to the 2019 Dove Crown Research Study. Professional stylists say the pressure to conform is damaging. And we as stylists, we don't want to straighten that much. We'll tell you, like, don't put that much heat on your hair. It's going to damage your hair. You're going to lose your hair. Senators Dina Neal and Dallas Harris pushed for the Crown Act protecting those who wear hairstyles like braids, locks, and twists. People lack education when it comes to hair. We are typically judged based off how our hair looks. People who don't understand, um, maybe have only had the influences of their families, they take those biases into the workplace. The Crown Act is life-changing. I think it's super important. I think it's amazing. As we break the chains of slavery, as we liberate ourselves as a people, as we liberate ourselves as a community, um, and as we work with our allies to bring equity and justice to, um, to our community, it is imperative that we let Black women be free, that we let them do what they want with their hair. Bianca Holman, 8 News Now.